following video will show you how to test for leaks and measure a sample in your ViscoLab PVT system. It is recommended you watch our introductory PVT video if you are not familiar with the layout of the PVT system and the name of its parts. We will now begin to verify viscosity with our PVT system. Open valve to the reservoir and draw a traceable calibration standard into the pump. Close reservoir valve and open reservoir inlet valve. Open sample inlet valve. Open the exhaust valve. Pump sample through the system until 10 to 15 cc's have bled through the exhaust valve. Open the transducer line valve to bleed out any air. Close the exhaust valve and continue pumping until the desired test pressure has been reached. Allow system adequate time to stabilize to make sure that the pressure is stable. If pressure continues to drop, check all of the fittings for leaks. The large gland nut should be torqued to 110 foot-pounds. The low torque nut should be torqued to 65 foot-pounds. The rest of the nuts should be torqued to 25 foot-pounds. Inspect weep holes in all of the fittings. Now you know how to load a sample and check for leaks in your ViscoLab PVT system. Now that your system is all connected and holding pressure, please reinstall the top insulation cover. Now we can begin taking measurements. Set the bath temperature on the PC display to the desired set point using the ViscoLab PVT software. Make sure the ViscoPro 2000 is in measure viscosity mode. Adjust the pressure until your desired test pressure has been reached by turning the fine adjust valve. Wait to stabilize. Once the viscosity standard deviation has dropped below 1%, your system is considered stable. You have now completed measuring your sample.